Hi everyone, today we are going to have a look at how to tie the plafond knot. This one is a nice decorative flat knot. You can use these as zipper pulls or if you add a split ring here at the top you can also use these as key fobs. I've tied mine with a diamond knot here down at the bottom just for a bit of extra ornamentation. I've already done the tutorial on this one so if you want to know how to tie it I'll leave a link in the description. To tie this one I want to start by middling my piece of cord and then just form a loop by taking the left hand strand over the right and then taking this strand around and down through that loop just to form a simple overhand knot. And we just want to repeat that process three more times. So take the left hand strand over the right and take that strand around and down through the loop to form another overhand knot. And then again, left over right and tie another one. And then one last one, taking the left over the right and around and through to form our last overhand knot. So the next part of this is to take our end and tuck it all the way through the center of each of these overhand knots. So I'll start by just pulling the first one apart a little bit, take my right hand strand down through that center. Then I can pull the next one apart a little bit and tuck my strand down through that one. and then down through the next one. And then finally down through the last overhand knot. So we should end up like this. And now we want to repeat that process with our left hand strand. But first we want to come in behind this leg here on the left. So behind that one and then again down through the center. Of the first one. Then the second one, and then the third, and then finally the fourth. So you want these two running exactly parallel through the center of the whole thing. And we can just pull that slack through. Then you should observe two lobes down here at the bottom. This right one and the left one. I want to take this left one behind and up to the top of the knot and this right lobe over the top and up to the top of the knot. And I want to do that at the same time. So just take these two right around and up to the top. Just keep folding them until you get them here at the top. Careful not to lose this top loop. And then just take out the slack by pulling 
these two strands down the bottom. Don't tighten it too much, just take a little bit of the slack out. Then you should find two lobes down the bottom again. Just pull them out a little bit. You should have a right lobe and a left lobe and we want to repeat that process. So take this left lobe around the back up to the top of the knot and this right lobe around the front to the top. Just fold them all the way around until they reach the top of the knot. So that's the tying process complete. Now we just need to tighten. And the way I like to tighten these up is just to grab the left hand strand here of the top loop and the opposite strand down the bottom. So that'll be the right hand strand and just give them a gentle tug just a little bit and then switch. So I'm going to take this top right leg and the bottom left leg and give it a bit of a tug and alternate between the two. as you tighten this knot down. And I'm tightening this in like kind of jerky motions. And you should end up with the finished plafond knot. And sometimes you might need to shape it a little bit as you're tightening it as well. Please share this video around your social media because that allows me to keep providing you guys with free knot tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.